This is what it looks like if you're truck racing and you try to stay out of trouble, Steffen. <laughs> so your mechanics are actually trying to fix everything for the next two races to come this weekend. And I was like, okay, I really want to see your garage. I want to know what's going on behind the scenes after race. So yeah. maybe you can quickly explain a little bit about what's going on over here. Ja, wir haben jetzt das Auto aus dem Park Fermé frei bekommen und dürfen jetzt schon dran arbeiten. Das heißt, wir machen jetzt ähm, einmal alles auseinander, machen die ganzen Verkleidungen ab und schauen erstmal den Schaden an. Und dann gehen wir in unser Lager rein und holen praktisch die einzelnen Teile raus, die wir benötigen und bauen das dann wieder langsam dran. Wird alles sauber gemacht, einmal einen Schraubencheck gemacht und dann gehen wir morgen wieder ins Qualifying. Okay, so they're trying to find everything that has been damaged on this truck, which is quite a lot, I would say. Uh, of course, they have to get all the spare parts together. They're inside the truck, so maybe we can also go inside the truck yes. in a second. And then, of course, they try to fix whatever technology has been broken, but also try to make this truck looking as good as can. So maybe we can quickly go inside. And as we're walking over, I have a quick overview for you what has been going on in the first two races with Stefan and his truck. Ja, im vorderen Bereich haben wir dann quasi ähm, einen Datenraum, wo unser Dateningenieur drin sitzt, wo quasi permanent ein neues Mapping macht oder eine Abänderung, dass wir äh, gerade mit dem Lambda-Wert hinkommen oder auch ähm, leistungstechnisch, wo wir sehen in den Daten, wo wir noch was holen können, da arbeiten wir ständig dran. Okay, so let's restart. If you walk into the workshop, first to the left, you will find the turbochargers, you also will find all the brake parts. So the whole truck more than less has been taking apart in different development uh, departures. So whenever you really quick search for something, you should be able to find it right away. So they also have windscreen sitting at the end of the truck, uh, injectors, whatever like the engine needs, what the cooling system needs. The, like every shelf has its own name and has its own department. And also they have an engineer sitting in front of the truck. So whenever it comes to Lambda, when it comes to like getting the measurements of the engine, whatever technology has been going on the truck, this guy is actually sitting there in his office and working on it. So it's quite interesting. It's not only about what's going on on the racetrack. It's really always about like as in every race, what's happening behind the scenes and what's happening with the team and the te technology that's actually being worked on. So he really is keen on having a very clean working space because if it's clean you really can see what's going on and you also more easily can see damages or whatever part has been taken apart. And of course to the sponsors it's also nice to have a nice setup where people want to take pictures where they want to have a look and not like a mess going on. And last thing I really love these working lights over there. Are they like the Steffen Fast design? No, I have seen them. Most in the Ausstellungshallen. Drin. Und ich fand es aber sehr interessant, weil wir immer Probleme haben. Wir müssen ja hier eine Werkstattatmosphäre schaffen und äh, müssen das Licht praktisch immer nutzen können, weil wir ja Tag und Nacht hier sind. Und ähm, dann hat mir das einfach gefallen, wie toll der Truck da drunter leuchtet. Und dann habe ich gesagt, wir müssen das schaffen, das hier ins Zelt zu bauen. Okay, so normally you would see this light at, at exhibitions, but he needed a work light that also gives like a nice atmosphere in the night, but also he wanted a light that makes the truck look really good. So he made the effort getting these lights, he managed to. And now we're standing here in a very well designed workspace. So thank you so much for taking the time and good luck for the next two races. Thank you. Vielen Dank. Vielen Dank.